And four, that class, Philip Rivers, Eli Manning, Ben Roethlisberger. Eli's got a couple, Ben's got a couple, Philip has none. Today, he'll be taking a step towards that march to the Lombardi Trophy, but they've got to get through the juggernaut that is the Patriots. They'll be playing at Gillette Stadium. A lot of folks saying it's not the same old Patriots, but it still is Tom Brady, it's still Bill Belichick. Let's talk about the Chargers, Patriots, 105, Chargers getting four. Josh Taylor. I like Philip Rivers finally slaying the dragon. I, I just talked about this on my show on the Sunday morning grind. I think he finally gets it done. He's never beaten Brady in his career, and he was eager to get out there and do it after they beat the, the Ravens. I think they finally do it. I love what the Chargers do. They are a very amazing road team. They're good at beating teams on the road. They came into Pittsburgh, 16 points now, came back and beat the Steelers. You could probably fault the Steelers for some of that, and you wouldn't be wrong, but the way this Chargers team, Chargers team plays on the road, Remember, Baltimore came to their field and smacked them around. First round, they go to Baltimore and they beat up on the Ravens. They, they are much better at home, they're much better road team than they are at home team right now. Superdome 440 in New Orleans, the Saints favored by eight against the Eagles. Before we talk anything about the game, you think they're gonna have to make a decision about whether they keep Nick Foles or not? Has he done that much to make them reconsider maybe Carson Wentz not being the guy? The decision to go to Nick Foles might have saved Philadelphia's season. That and getting a hand on a kick by Cody Parkey at the end of that Chicago game. But going to Nick Foles might be the difference maker. Do they win that Super Bowl with Carson Wentz instead of Nick Foles? I don't know, but I had Car I had Nick Foles pegged as the MVP of that game before it kicked off. So Nick Foles has been the difference, honestly, and you do have to make a tough decision, I think, at the end of the season. Is he good enough to get by Drew Brees? He was good enough to beat New England last year. However, you're talking about beating Drew Brees in New Orleans, where they have not lost when Drew Brees starts a playoff game. As much as I just talked about how good the Chargers are on the road, New Orleans is lights out at home. I think the, I think the, the Saints actually win this one. Sunday morning, Brian, 93.7, The Fan, KDK8, TV2. Don't forget, Coons Market, Black and Gold Sunday show today at 11 a.m. on KDK Radio.